How's it going guys? So, welcome to another video. I assume a few of you guys watching this have probably seen a post that I put up on YouTube and it was asking about a vote on some bosses. Now I said that I wouldn't tell you guys what the uh, reason for that was and you would have to just watch the video. So you're about to find out what that is now basically. So, I have come up with another, another idea for a different sort of uh, video and I think you guys might enjoy this quite a bit. Basically, what we're going to start doing is, if this video is well received anyway, we're going to do two hours of PVM based on a boss that you guys vote for. And then if whatever we make money-wise from that boss, whether we get an incredibly rare drop and whatever happens, we have to take that and stake it at the Duel Arena. We'll sell off the items more than likely first, get the cash, and then go and stake that away. Now, we could win, and if we win a hell of a lot, then we will be walking away. We won't be just staking until we lose it, because either way, the outcome that way would just be a loss altogether. So, we're going to have to be good at realizing that this is as far as we're going to go, and then stop. But, obviously, we could lose everything as well. Now, of course, we're only going to be staking the stuff that we get from the boss, so it's not going to be like a, a huge loss, basically. If anything, I can look at it as I have invested two hours of time and if I come out with nothing, then it's only two hours gone and you guys might get some entertainment out of it. Hopefully you find this uh, quite interesting. Get in the comments and let me know what you think about it. If you think it's a good idea, um, if you enjoyed the video when you get to the end of it. And hopefully uh, something quite exciting happens, whether we win or lose. Could be a laugh either way, but the boss that you guys voted for today was going to be Telos. So that's where we're going to start. I've just finished off my last streak, so we don't have to worry about that. Completely from scratch, I assume it's probably going to be better to start maybe at about 150 to 200%. I think I might probably start at 200%, do that for two hours, see how much money we can make. And if we get an orb, then I'll have to figure out what I'm going to do about the value of that. Anyway, let's get started. So this is basically going to be kind of like a live recording, I suppose. So I'm going to basically just do two hours of doing telos because that's what you guys have chosen and i'm gonna have the microphone on full time so everything all of my reactions anything that goes wrong anything like that is all going to be recorded and hopefully that makes it quite a lot more interesting for you guys and we might get some funny reactions out of it so we've got all of our stuff ready we're pretty much ready to go i'm on a different aura because i just finished off my other kill just so i could claim my streak without having to die and stuff like that so we are going to be using Maniacal, and we will activate that and extend it. We'll probably have to reset for the second hour, but that's not a problem. So let's get that done, and uh, let's just crack on. Let's get straight in there. So we shouldn't have too much problem early on, I assume, and hopefully we do get some sort of a drop or even just build up a decent amount of money. Like I said, I assume that after doing two hours of Telos anyway from 200%, we we'll should have a decent amount of money to go on stake. If we get a good sort of rare drop, then that's even better. But preferably something I can sell. An orb, I'm really unsure how I'm going to cover that. Because I think they're like 280 mil at the moment, technically. And I don't have that much money to put into it. So we'll see what happens. Um, but let's go ahead and start this off. And we'll figure that out if we get to that point. Because I don't expect to actually get an orb. So yeah, this is going to be a lot different than my normal kills. Because I'm using the microphone, but that's no problem. And not getting the beam for the life of me. Ah, I forgot the hold still. What am I doing? Okay. Let's start paying a bit more attention now. But we're alright. We'll get through it. Normally if I ever start a streak, it's always on 0 or 100%. So it feels a lot more easier. Whereas now I kind of feel like I'm thinking I'm on that rage, but I'm not. There we go. Now we should be on the uppercut first, I think. So at least we don't have the hold still. That's definitely something we don't want to have to deal with. Oh no, we didn't get in the beam before we still unlocked him. God damn, that's not good. This is a terrible P3. <laughs> Absolutely typical. First time and all. Right, we should be fine with this phase. It was a bit messy, but we should be absolutely fine. So I'm not sure how many kills an hour I'm going to end up getting, but I assume it should add up to enough anyway. And imagine if we got something like a uh, God Sword or something like that to sell off. We need to not, preferably not walk him. I think I might have just done it anyway. Lou. No, Crackling. Crackling just screwed us right up there. Pretty sure we're going to be tanking this first so much power. Thanks to Crackling. You broke free. Where is it? 
Oh, crap. There we go. We're all right. That was messy as hell, though. There we go. P5, let's go. So this is taking quite a while, this kill. Um, I feel like I just needed to get into it a little bit, though. So we should be fine. The next one should be quite a little bit quicker. And we're on Souls, not Reaper. Hmm. This is a very bad phase five. What the frick am I doing? That was probably one of the worst phase fives I've ever had to do. <laughs> like, since I've learned how to do it, that is probably one of the worst ones. And there we go. So we still got it in one cycle, but that was ridiculous how bad that was. So first drop, 567K, that's not too bad. So we're gonna end up building up quite a bit, I think, if this continues. And onslaught, there we go. That should pretty much be the end of the kill now. <laughs> There we go. Kill number two. More salvage. And onslaught. There we go. No, the rock. I didn't see the rock. Is it too late? Oh, we're good. <laughs> I thought that rock came before I'd even seen it. I must have seen it just as it happened, but some energies continue on. I actually got it. <laughs> that was the worst P5 in my life, though. That was literally... So freaking bad. I didn't do anything bad like the normal rotation. 2.4 mil. Dragon Hide continue challenge. Okay, so our one is up and our loot, I feel like it's quite low to be honest. Uh, our loot after one hour is 3 mil. It was only 6 kills, but 3 mil I feel is quite low. Hmm. Well, hopefully the second hour is really lucky and we get a bit extra. Otherwise, we are not going to the Delorean with a lot of money. So I didn't end up recording all the audio for the second hour. It was getting a little bit high in rage and I didn't want to screw it up, seeing as I could already tell that by the end of it, unless we got a big drop, we wouldn't have had a lot of money to go ahead and stake away. So I wanted to make sure I would not die and that we'd have as much as possible. And we did end up getting around about nine mil in total. So that's not too bad. I'll probably throw one mil in myself just to make it a nice round 10 mil. And uh, now we can go ahead and stake this at the Duel Arena, see how it goes. And hopefully it doesn't all just go in one go. Obviously 10 mil's not a lot, but you never know. It could be quite interesting anyway. Okay, so we're here at the Duel Arena. Um, I think I've set everything up properly. So I've got my Poly4 staff on. I have selected the right ability and we are on Legacy. I'm pretty sure that's literally all we need to do. Um, so now the next thing is going to be just finding someone who's going to be doing a low sort of stake. A lot of people um, do try and do like scams and stuff. So guys, I don't recommend that you guys come here. I'm only doing this purely for fun. And obviously, I'm only going to lose two hours if I lose everything. So, like I said, I don't recommend you guys come here and try and win loads of money unless uh, you've got basically loads of money to waste. But if you do come, then keep an eye out for the people that are literally just trying to steal from you. This guy wants to do one mil. Let's start with that. And then at least we can check, like, our settings and stuff. So when you do this, you want to check their inventory, make sure they've got nothing there. Check what they're wearing. Make sure they have nothing there that you don't have as well. And, of course, just... Uh, check all the settings as well okay so number one let's go barely even so far Brig, he crit me this is gonna be a loss I'm pretty sure yeah <laughs> two crits in a row oh well that's no problem at least we did it with a one but let's uh see if we can find someone to do another one okay so we got another one here just click use previous then we know that it'll be absolutely fine because that's what we did last time and that wasn't any sort of scam or anything check his inventory check what he's wearing and make sure that's up all right again let's go okay let's go decent start kind of okay this isn't looking terrible one more hit come on no we've just freaking hit it Come on. Yes, good stuff. So we won. There we go. We're up one mil now. So we'll do a few lower stakes. And then if we do happen to win, uh, then we can always move up to higher amounts. Okay, round three. 
so far looking so good. Okay, this is fairly even. I'm not sure what to think of this. Like, I know it can turn so quickly because you can just crit. We won again. So now we are up to 13 mil. That is not too bad. But guys, this is why it can be addicting, obviously. <laughs> so just uh, keep that in mind. Okay, we should be good. Let's go. Let's go. Small hits to begin with. Ah, uh, it's pretty close. Good hit. Come on, one more. We won again. I was not expecting to be winning this much. So we've gone from 10 mil up to 16 mil. Now, I'm not sure if I mentioned earlier on, but if this goes like really high, then of course we're just going to stop and make sure to know when to leave. Um, but we're not going to stop at like 16 mil or something like that. We'll um, we'll do this 8 mil over here, maybe. And if, if it gets high, then we will leave. But um, we'll see what happens and we'll see when we decide to actually do that. See, now they've got all this stuff in here. It's just not worth it. Like, there's no reason for him to have that. So let's just not bother. I don't know what all the lures are myself. So as soon as I've got dodgy items and stuff, I'm just not going to bother. So, so far, it's been pretty good. I don't expect to win another one in a row, though. There's, like, no way. Then again, those hits. What the hell? We could get double critted, so let's not get our hopes up too high. See? We can hit that again. But we won again. From 10 mil to 19 mil. See, this is why, no matter what sort of money we start with, we can always just come anyway and see what happens. Right, if we win again, then we're going from half to half of basically whatever we've got. Okay, fairly even so far. He's slightly ahead. Ooh, this is freaking close. Anyone could win on this one, I think, with a crit. I think he's got pit as well, so good chance that we're not going to win this one. Ah, uh, we lost that one. Okay, no problem. Okay, four mil. Oh, good start. Come on, one more hit. Surely one more hit is ours. <gasps> no way. As if we lost that. What the frick? That was so close. Let's go. 443. Come on. I think he's got pit as well. Oh, damn it. That could have been it. Oh, we won. Good stuff. Okay, so we're back to 14 mil. We're playing like a lot of like up and down on this. Okay, 7 mil. Let's go. Come on, JX. Big hits. <gasps> oh, he doesn't... He's not set up properly. Those hits, I would have lost big time. <laughs> oh, no. Where is he at? I can't take that off him. But I can't remember his name. Where is Where is he? Where's he gone? I want to give it him back, but I literally can't find him at all. And I don't remember his name. I'm assuming this is long gone now. Well, if he comes back and asks for it, then... Uh, We'll give it to him, but we shouldn't have won the last one, though, to be fair. Ah, uh, no, we're going to get wrecked this time, aren't we? Come on, big hits. Make him splash. Make him do, like, 10 or something. Who's got pit? I think that's pretty much who, who wins this time. We won again. We're up to 26 mil. Right, I'm not sure what um, amount we should probably leave on, but not just yet. Okay, 10 mil stake. Let's see how it goes. This is a big one. Come on, Jagex. Be kind. Okay, so far we're slightly ahead, but it literally means nothing. That was good. You have YouTube. This guy knows who we are. This guy knows who we are. We won another 10 mil. What the frick? So we came with 10 mil, and now we're on 36. Okay, let's go again. If we can win this one, then we're walking away. If not, then we'll do some more, of course. So far, so good. Oh, that's going to hurt. We're going to lose this one, absolutely. 
Who's got ped? Oh my frick. Okay, this is literally like not much money. But to me at the moment, 46 mil <laughs> from 10 mil is really good. So what we're going to do is leave it at that. We're not going to push our luck. We've just won a good 36 mil in about 25 minutes. Okay, so we did just record an outro with the last little clip. And to be honest, it was pretty terrible because I was a bit shocked about the fact that I just won. Now, of course, going from 10 mil to 46 mil for me is big. But for a lot of you guys watching, it's probably nothing. It's probably a little bit of pocket change. However, like I said, this is going to be something that I plan on doing for a while. So having that extra money will be amazing for getting Boston supplies with doing it. Because, of course, I'm risking quite a lot where I could be spending quite a lot of money on doing supplies and stuff and then leaving with nothing. And if that happens in, in a row quite a few times, I'm going to be setting myself back on supplies and costs and stuff. But that amount of money there is pretty much all the costs I'm going to need for a lot of episodes of this. So hopefully we can get some luck carrying on in the future, but you never know. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, of course. And if you did, then make sure to leave a like. The more likes this video gets, then I will know for sure that you guys are enjoying it. Get in the comments and let me know. And obviously, if it does get a good reaction, plenty of likes, plenty of comments and stuff, then I'll make the other one a lot quicker because there's no reason for me not to if you're really enjoying it. And it was a lot of fun for me to do as well. And I can make these videos fairly quick. So let me know if you enjoy them enough and I'll make sure to go ahead and make them. Of course, if you're new, then do subscribe. If you enjoy this sort of content, then like I said, I'll continue doing it. And I'll see you in the next video. See you later, guys. Bye.